What's going on everyone, Grimjump Gaming back here. In today's video, I'm going to be going over how you can get more Battle Pass XP in Apex Legends Season 12. As we start to get closer to the end of the season, you definitely want to make sure you have your free Battle Pass completed, especially if you paid for the Premium Battle Pass. You'll definitely want to make sure you get your money back out of it and make sure you max out your Battle Pass. With that being said, let's get straight into the video. The first thing to go over about leveling up your Battle Pass, which is common knowledge, Battle Pass XP is basically these little stars. If you get 10 stars, you end up getting one level of battle pass progression. And these stars can be earned in various ways. The first way of getting battle pass XP is through challenges. There are daily challenges and then weekly challenges. Daily challenges can be reset as well as weekly challenges, but of course daily challenges are only around for a day. They are usually more simple than the ones you get with your weekly challenges. Challenges in Apex Legends usually get done passively. You won't even know they're being done. There are some in there that are super easy like getting some damage with a character you don't play and all you really have to do is just run a game with that character. When looking closer in the challenges section there is a pretty neat feature which lets you grind xp in order to create these battle pass stars every time you get 5000 xp you will get an xp star and then of course you get 10 of those stars you end up getting a battle pass progression what is so nice about this is you get XP from literally every action you do inside Apex Legends. I will leave a more detailed guide on how to farm XP in the description, but some of the best ways to get XP are by getting kills, doing damage, time survived, and a couple others, but those are the biggest factors that will give you the most XP, which will go towards leveling up your battle pass. The next thing is when you go into your season hub, there will also be this tab named episodes, and this is the treasure pack place, which pretty much tracks the treasure packs that you collect and gives you rewards for doing so. Treasure packs have two main purposes and that is to unlock the comics which tie into the Apex Legends story but few people know that treasure packs actually give you rewards. They do reward you with battle pass stars but they also reward you with crafting medals and Apex Legends packs. The last thing I'll go over is the alternative ways to get battle pass XP. During LTM events usually they will come out with a little battle pass tracker for that event when you level up the events mini battle pass usually you will end up getting pretty nice rewards but along with those are battle pass progression levels and battle pass xp one more thing to mention if you have bought the premium battle pass you will find that there are already battle pass progression levels already in it let's say you unlock level 51 on your battle pass and it has an xp progression token whatever you want to call it then you will immediately unlock level 52 just like like that with all of that being said thank you guys all so much for watching definitely make sure to subscribe for more content like this it comes at no cost to you and you could always unsubscribe later a big thank you to my subscribers and channel members have a great rest of your day and i'll see you all around later bye guys